if you want sustainable change, it needs to be organically from those in the ground, on the field. Um, those are the folks that really are going to make the longer term changes happen. Sometimes there's a problem that people who are in um, a field for a long time move up in responsibility, but sometimes lose touch with the reality on the ground. And it's important for all of us to get that grounding, to go to the field, not to stay in our ivory towers and think that we understand the problems, because things also change. And it's really the frequent interactions with the folks that are in the front lines um, that are going to tell us whether our solutions make sense. One of the things that Skoll realized early in the pandemic was the importance of cross-sectional collaboration. That is, that there were so many groups that were impacted by the pandemic, but working in silos, those groups were going to be much less effective and frankly, even running up against each other. And Skoll, for example, funded early the COVID Collaborative, which is a US-based organization that brings together experts and leaders and organizations that are really working together in the pandemic space. It really is that collaboration, the voices of all those folks working together, that's gonna have the biggest impact and really lead to the most meaningful change. I've totally enjoyed working for the U.S. government. Um, bureaucracy moves slowly. And I think what attracts me to Skoll is the ability to move fast, to fill gaps, to be entrepreneurial and to take risks. I think philanthropy has a unique niche in really catalyzing um, change. And I'm excited to explore the possibilities.